Four animals were found stabbed in the head and face Saturday morning in an after-school agriculture program at Gonzales High. Two lamb are now dead, and one lamb and piglet are recovering. I can't even fathom it in my head why somebody would want to do this. Gonzales PD is currently investigating the gruesome attack caught on surveillance footage. My first thought is our, our kids, our children, you know, we have nine to 19 year old kids down here and sometimes they're down here early in the morning to feed and they come at night. The animals are raised by students ages nine to 19 that are in the nonprofit program 4-H to be later sold at the Salinas Valley Fair in May. <laughs> Seppelin the pig, one of two animals that survived the attack. Yeah, you create pretty strong bonds with them, give them your name and you walk them. They start to correspond to you, so it's like it's like it's it's your own, it's your pet. Students and program leaders say the lamb that were killed were the more friendly of the bunch, often going up to anyone at the gate. 13-year-old Santiago Cuevas' lamb survived the attack and now recovering from a broken leg and gash to the head. My lamb was pretty scared and that may be the reason why it was able to survive the incident. As for the students whose animal didn't survive, the community stepping up with donations. And within days, the students were able to get three new lamb at a discounted price. In the span of a weekend, that's, it's wild how much support, how great everybody is. And as you can imagine, program leaders are on edge now. Students that are a part of the program have to be accompanied by an adult when visiting their animals. In Gonzales, I'm Christian Balderas, KSBW, Action News 8 Sunrise.